need to worry about that. Yes. yes. My goodness. <laughs> Too warm and too wet. <laughs> too warm and too wet for sure, and that causes fog this time mm -hmm. of year. Uh, we are back under a dense fog advisory, and I've got a couple of views for you. We will start Bunker Hill, where you can see the headlights, but you really very difficult to see across the street. Uh, there is a farm field there across the street, and you can't see across the lake. This is Morse Reservoir, so travel with caution. Here are a couple of tips to help you stay weather aware. Driving in the fog, make sure you use those low beam headlights. Uh, and you can also use those road reflectors as a guide if it gets really bad and always keep a safe distance from other cars and slow down a little bit. Just a little extra travel time is a good idea as we are under a dense fog advisory through early tomorrow morning. We do expect some additional school delays tomorrow morning, so set your alarm clock a little early for your Thursday. It'll be a foggy start. Visibility's right now near zero in several locations, including Kokomo, Shelbyville, Lafayette, Greencastle, and Terre Haute. Visibility in Indianapolis is one mile on live Doppler 13 radar underneath the fog. We have areas of drizzle and a few spotty showers as well from Newcastle to Knightstown into Morristown in our eastern viewing area from just south of Richmond, Connorsville over toward Liberty, some steadier light rain. Our last local stop will be to the south where again we've got some steadier light rain south of Indianapolis and this will continue to fall. The areas of drizzle uh, Bedford, Brownstown, Seymour up into Columbia. Columbus and hope and we have additional heavy rain on the way for tomorrow. Numbers from today too warm for any snow 53 and 42 well above the averages of 36 and 20. We did pick up just under a third of an inch of rain officially at the airport in Indianapolis and between now and early Friday the potential for another quarter half three quarters of an inch of rain as we get into tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow night. That's when we're forecasting another wave of heavier rain. It'll be rain and not snow 40s and 50s tomorrow. We're going to start future track 13 early tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. We're dealing with the fog mist and drizzle. Steadier rain starts to arrive after lunchtime. That's four o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Heavy pockets of rain will continue through late Thursday night. That's 11 p.m. before it lifts north, but we're stuck with the clouds and the drizzle around on Friday. High temperatures on Friday also in the 40s. So the seven day forecast is a mild one 51 tomorrow fall and then some heavy rain 46 on Friday. Another system to track for the upcoming weekend that does bring us some rain on Saturday and there will be some colder air with this one. So we may see that change over to a little rain snow mix on Sunday. Something we'll watch for you as we get closer to the weekend. All right. Thanks so much, Angela.